Hey guys, welcome to my new YouTube channel. If this is your first time checking it out, go ahead and hit the subscribe button at the bottom. If you're watching this on my NA2 and SX page, make sure you subscribe to the Hard Parking Podcast page. The link will be in the description. If you're watching this on the podcast page, make sure you subscribe, obviously, to my car page. Today, I'm going out to Wright Honda to do a charity event with a friend of mine, Jane, who reached out for a young boy who's terminally ill named Brendan. There's gonna be a lot of exotic cars there. We're talking McLaren 720Ss. We're talking these R8, 1,000 horsepower GTRs, Aventadors, Huracons, 458s, did I say that already? This is the time of social distancing, so I will have a mask on my face. Let's get out of here. I haven't been able to look out my rear view mirror in, God, at least what well, seems like three years. Because when I got the car wrapped in October of 2017, I had what's called window perf that went on the back. So what window perf is, and some of you already know, but for some of you who don't, what window perf is, it's, it looks like it's opaque, like you can't see through it, but it's got a bunch of tiny holes. So typically you see it on the side of commercial buildings. You'll see it on the side of uh, some commercial vehicles driving around. And at some point, someone decided that it would look kind of cool on a car too, so you cover the window. I think I was one of the first guys in the tuner world aftermarket world to cover my windows with window perp so the rear in theory i would have would have been able to see out of it but in reality i couldn't see shit so i always relied on cameras in the car to see for me i had a tiny camera up here and i have another tiny one in the rear view and it's just one of those crazy bizarre things so i took the wrap off about a month ago and I'm still getting used to looking back there because I'm just not used to being able to see out of the rear. I got I got to show you guys my setup uh, when I get to where I'm going. It's pretty janky. It's all I have. It's a tripod. It's like a $20 tripod off of Amazon that I bought a couple years ago. In fact, the camera fell down earlier when I was pulling out of my own driveway. But I'm running late. I'm always running late. I'm supposed to meet the guys at 9. The event starts at 10. It's 9.15 and I just left my house. I still gotta get gas. And then the event at Wright Honda is about 30 minutes away past that. Jane invited me. She's the most charitable person I've ever met. There's two groups going. I'm not in any, either of those groups. So they're gonna be looking at me like, what the hell is this car doing here? However, it is a Honda dealership. And technically this is a Honda NSX. This is it. This is my, uh... My fancy device that I've been carrying around. This is gonna hold my my phone today because I don't even have a real DSLR. But uh, I do have Filmic Pro and I've never used it, but I'm gonna use it today. I'm not using it right now. I'm just using my native uh, video. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, I just got here. No one's using social distancing and hardly anybody has masks. So now I'm the odd man out, but I promised my wife I'd mask up, so I'm masking up. So many nice cars out here. Sound muffled because I'm wearing the mask that my mother in law made me. They have a whole setup inside. It's always really good, man. I mean, Jane, she knows what to do. Right, Honda, they know, know what to do. That's why they trust her to do all this stuff. Serving free breakfast to anybody who's here. You can buy raffle tickets. I went for the eggs and hash browns. I hate hash browns. Got some fruit. And I got my mask. I'm mean, good, good to go. That's it guys, hopefully you enjoyed my video. So I have an issue, a couple things. Number one, the tripod broke. So it's time for me to buy a new tripod. Number two, I filmed half the footage in the wrong frame rate, which is a common thing. I don't remember if I tried to shoot 4K or maybe I was trying to do time-lapse. It must've been time-lapse. 
because the video footage is really fast, so I apologize. If you're watching from my NA2 NSX page, make sure you subscribe also to the podcast page. If you're watching from the podcast page, subscribe to my car page. Both of them are down in the description. Again, subscribe and just keep watching because the content's gonna get better and better and better. Until next time, Hard Parking Podcast out.